My Celtics in six pick is still a little bit up in the air, but that's okay because I don't have a dog in this race. But what I do want to know is, is the excitement around Lakers new head coach warranted? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to The Fumble. I'm Jackie Ray or Jackie Ray TV if you want to follow me on Instagram, YouTube, or Twitter. But before you do that, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. Now, if you dwell in the kingdom like myself or if you're a diehard Laker fan, can we all just collectively agree that this season was a complete cluster? You know what I'm trying to say. Brody couldn't find his footing to save his life, and I don't know what he's doing with his offseason, but since it seems like he isn't going anywhere, he better get it together. Because he's one of my favorite players, but he was the missed shot and turnover king. Frank Vogel is gone, which is great, and we still don't know if Anthony Davis can stay healthy. And with every year, we should just expect King James to need more rest days. Add all that up, and I have no idea how King James and company are going to have a better season next year. But if you ask Irvin Magic Johnson, the first step to the turnaround is the hiring of the Lakers' new head coach, Darvin Ham. Magic tweeted the Lakers press conference to introduce my friend Darvin Ham as the coach of the Lakers was truly amazing. I enjoyed listening to him talk about accountability, defense, spacing on the offensive end, sacrifice, competitiveness, and toughness. He tweeted that on an Android, though, so I don't know. I'll admit that's probably just me being bougie, but an Android magic. Anyway, he went on to tweet, he won a championship as a coach with the Bucks and as a player with the Pistons. He knows winning and championship basketball. Coach Ham has also made a promise to Laker fans. He has promised to return Laker Nation to its glory and has stated, stay tuned, we're coming. What kind of Laker fan by way of LeBron would I be if I doubted the man? But I'll leave that to Twitter. This user said, sometimes it's not the coach. If this team are all a bunch of veterans, it's those kind of players around that team. There is just so much pressure to play alongside LeBron and Westbrook is just not a good mix all along. While this user said, but will he make Anthony Davis play his center position, dominate the paint on offense and defense and stay away from the three point line? All great points. So what are your thoughts? If all the Lakers are going to change is the coach, will they have a different outcome next season? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Once again, I'm Jackie Ray, and thanks for watching The Fumble.